Hi guys, welcome to my channel. My name is Kat and I am so excited that you're here. Look at these tropical eyes. I am so excited to show you guys how to do this. I promise you that it is not hard. You just have to have patience. So if you are in a rush, do not, do not attempt to do this. I have created a lot of looks in my lifetime, but never anything quite like this. So I was like, my YouTube friends would probably like to do this with me. I would love so much if you create this look. Please let me know. You can tag me on Instagram. My Instagram name is Katson89. So it's C-A-T-S-O-N-89. Check me out and I'll check you out. That didn't mean to sound weird. So we're going to talk about a couple of things before we get into this full face. When I was younger, so in my early 20s, I was one of those girls that was like, Oh, I don't need sunscreen. I just want to be tanned. Oh, I don't need moisturizer. My skin is perfect. Ha ha ha. Okay, I'm 35 almost next month. And guess what's happened to my face? Yeah. All that stuff they warn you about when you're in your early 20s, don't be like me. I was dumb as a day-old pig, I'm telling you. You should keep your face and your body out of the sun. I know that you're thinking right now, well, you have a nice tan. Well, yes, thank you. I use self-tanner. Please check out my previous video. That's how I have this beautiful Brazilian glow. I don't know if it's Brazilian, but I feel like a tropical princess right now. And I want you to feel the same way. So we're going to get into this look real quick. Just a couple tips here. That's why I'm suggesting you use a self tanner because it is good for your skin. You don't have to go out into the sun. You should be wearing sunscreen. I'm not your mother, but I'm going to mother you right now. And you can also buy foundation that does have an SPF in it. You just have to check the bottle and it will say, or you can Google it and it will tell you what kind of foundations you should use. I also like to wear a hat often just to keep the sun off of my face because I am suffering immensely from my mistakes when I was 20 and my, oh, I don't need to listen to you. My skin's perfect. I'm 20. Ha ha. Kind of lifestyle. So wear a hat, drink lots of water, keep your skin moisturized. I know I sound like your mother, but someone's got to do it because they did it to me and I didn't listen. I want to talk to you guys about the sponge that I'm going to be using. I know that I've briefly touched on it a couple of times in the past in my favorites videos or in my foundation videos as well. I always use the same kind of sponge. It is by Juno & Co. and it is this velvet soft texture. I'm sorry, she's she is clean, but she's stained a little bit. But it is this wonderful velvet soft. Oh, I love it. I have tried a million different beauty sponges and this one I will always continue to buy. It's only six dollars. It's six dollars. The beauty blender at Sephora is tw I think twenty two dollars. This girl is not paying twenty two dollars for a sponge. Thank you very much. This one I will continue to buy to the dawn of time. This is now my second time purchasing this. I will keep buying them. I think I went a good six months with the other one before I had to replace it. It wasn't absolutely falling apart, but she, you know, I used it every day for six months. So I'm going to tell you a little bit about it and then we can get on with the video. So let me tell you. It says, if you're looking for a more natural airbrushed foundation finish, the Juno Microfiber Sponge is your go-to. I'm serious, it is. It says that on here, but it's my go-to. Made with velvet soft micro bristles and a slanted edge for controlled stippling, the Juno Micro Velvet Sponge provides buildable coverage fast. That is true. You can use it wet, wet it, squeeze it, stipple it. Perfect for liquid foundations, concealers, and contouring. Use it dry. Just like I do, you'll see in the video, I do use it with my foundation and then I use it with my setting powder as well. It says use it dry, dip it, tap it, pat it. Perfect for powders, bronzers, blush, and highlighters. So the website is thejuno, 
www.ebaybooks.co. That's where I order it from, and I highly recommend this, not just because it's super affordable, but because it is the perfect application for your foundation, and your powder, and your blush, and your contour. I will die without this sponge. I will freak out on somebody. Anyways. <laughs> okay, enough about that. Please remember to give me a thumbs up if you like this video, and please leave me a comment what you think of this lovely tropical eye look for the summer. I'm digging it. I'm just digging it. Hello. It's me. Alright guys, if you want to see how I created this full face of makeup, keep on watching.
Thank you guys so much for watching. I hope that you enjoyed this tutorial. If you have any questions or comments, please leave them down below because I love hearing from you guys. And I hope that you enjoy your summer and I will talk to you on the next one. Bye! Oh, look how cute those nails are. I'll go.